Hi everyone, thank you so much for checking out this video. If you're new here, my name is Stephanie and I cover oily skin, hooded eyes, and beauty. In today's video, I'm gonna be testing out the Rare Beauty Perfect Strokes Matte Liquid Liner and see if it's hooded eye approved. Also, I will be doing an all day wear test just to make sure that it does everything that it claims. This is a long wearing waterproof matte liquid eyeliner with over 1000 vegan bristles. It won't smudge, streak, or feather. So let's go ahead and put that to the test. Let's go ahead and talk about the packaging. It is super cute and I love the way it feels. It has that like soft matte texture. I don't know how else to describe it, but that's what comes to mind. And I love this little gold accent with the cream colored packaging. It's really, really cute. I also think it's gonna be really cute when storing because with this little gold accent, I'll be able to tell this is the Rare Beauty Liquid Eyeliner. So it says that this has over 1000 vegan bristles. So I kind of like that. I do like the felt tips as well, but I kind of like this one a little bit more. I feel like it's a little bit more flexible and easier to handle. Um, but yeah, so we definitely will see how this applies. I do wanna do the smell test. I don't know why I always like to smell things, but I just wanna make sure that whenever I put something on my face, it's not gonna be like crazy scented to where it makes me sick to my stomach. Here we go. Oh, I don't smell anything, that's good. I don't even know why I do the smell test because the lightest scents don't really affect me because I have like the worst sense of smell. So it has to be really strong for it to actually make me sick. So I don't know, I'm just a weirdo maybe. <laughs> So let me know down in the comments below, do you guys like to smell y'all's face products as well? And I'm not saying, you know, you smell it every time you are about to apply it, but like whenever you first receive something, like you just take it out of the packaging and then you go and smell it to make sure it's okay. I don't know. I don't know. Just let me know I'm not alone. <laughs> okay, anyway, let's get started. So it does say to shake before use. So I will be doing that winged liner for hooded eyes. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's that winged liner that kind of has like this geometric shape to it. <laughs> I did do a video just on that. So if you wanna check that out, I will go ahead and put the card up here or the whatever it's called right up here. So that way you guys can see it right after this video. I have my mirror right down here. Already, this is so smooth. So this is a lot thicker than I actually wanted, but that's okay. Let me go ahead and just do the line on the other eye and then we'll get into the wing liner. So just applying the line here on my eyelid, it was actually really nice and I'm touching it to see if it dried down and it's already dried. And let me just blink to make sure there is no transfer. It looks really, really good. And just so you guys know, I'm not wearing anything on top of my eyelids just foundation because I knew I wasn't really going to be doing any eyeshadow on top so all I'm wearing is my foundation and then um, translucent powder of course to set it. I did do some bronzer just in the crease just to kind of create that illusion for hooded eyes that I actually have a crease. That's it. So nothing else. That's all I wanted to do just because I really want the focus to be just on the eyeliner. So I'm going to go ahead and create the wing. So bringing that line down just now was super easy. Normally when you have, you know, hooded eyes, there's so much skin, there could be tugging and like even skipping because of all that skin. But the application, like the bristles just helped me glide down like no problem at all. So that was really nice. wing one down and this was really, really nice. The application just was so nice. Again, no tugging, no skipping. It was beautiful. All right, I'm gonna do the other eye. Okay, so the wings are on. The next thing to do is put on my mascara, so I will be right back. All right, so I am back with my mascara and I went ahead and just put on some lipstick. If you are curious, I will link everything that I used on my face down below. Overall, this eyeliner is absolutely gorgeous. But of course, the real test is how it wears all day. I definitely wanna make sure that I am testing out the transfer proof, smudge proof, flake proof, 
pretty much everything proof. I really wanna try that out and let you guys know if I think that this is hooded eye approved. So definitely stick around and I'll be right back. Back for my check-in and it's been about eight hours that I've been wearing this eyeliner and it looks so good. It held up perfectly. There's no flaking, no smudging, no cracking, no creasing, no transfer, nothing. Let me just show you guys. So this is definitely another great eyeliner that is hooded eye approved. So let me know down in the comments below, have you guys tried this eyeliner? Do you like it? Do you not? If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up and subscribe for more content. Thanks.